event to honor the 14 women and 12 men who donated their bodies to science. It is honorable to donate one's organs for surgical implantation into someone else's body whose own body systems are failing. Donors are still greatly needed here in New York and the country at large. We embark on promoting the donor program is to follow the example of those we are honoring today. I hope generations of the future students will acquire good anatomical knowledge by studying the various organs and other parts of the body that have been donated by these individuals. Although there's evidence of human dissections around 300 BC in Alexandria, it was not, around, it was not until around 1200 in Italy that the formal study of anatomy was required for physicians. It then took, around, it took until the 1500s with Versalius and Leonardo before numerous ancient myths of the body were dispelled of because of human dissection, like we've done. This year, we have joined this rich historical line due to the tremendous generosity of our donors. There's so much suffering in creation as we know it. We remember today those who've made a difference in the relieving of that suffering by generosity that will never die. We thank our anatomical donors, their families, their friends for the gift of knowledge. They leave a legacy of healing for future generations. They live on in the lives of those who benefit from their great gift. Mercy. You have commanded us to hold our bodies sacred while we are alive and also after we have passed on. You forbid us to mutilate our bodies in life and even in death. Our sages insist that all our remains must be interred into the earth. But we also read in the Torah, you shall fulfill all the commandments of God and live by them. Our sages teach us that means live by them and not die by them. Um, the words that uh, were spoken by all of you today were very, very meaningful. Uh, they say that words from the heart go to the heart, and I think everyone here felt how you felt, and uh, I think that would have been very important to Wallace. Um, <clears throat> he specifically wanted to give to you the benefit of what, you've, what, what you need. As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear the starry crown? Good Lord, show me the way. Oh, sisters, let's go down, let's go down, come on down. Oh, sisters, let's go down, down in the river to pray. As I went down in the river to pray, studying about that good old way, and who shall wear the robe and crown? Good Lord, show me the way. In closing, I ask that my instructors and my fellow classmates join me in standing up and thanking the donors and their families. For what has been done doesn't just help us as doctors in training, but it impacts all of humankind. Please join me in thanking them. that good old way and who shall wear the starry crown good lord show me